It's been over two weeks since Stars' is time-traveling drama Outlander, wrapped up its season four with young Ian, John Bell, triumphing as the man of worth, and Roger McKenzie, Richard Rankin, hesitatingly returning to the arms of his beloved, Brianna Randall Fraser, Sophie Skelton. The finale, despite a happy ever after, wasn't really the kind of closure fans expected in the season, because, first of all, Roger hesitated, and second of all, Murtaugh Fitzgibbons, Duncan LeCraw, fate is in question and also, we never saw how the Frasers reacted to Roger's return. Jamie Fraser, Sam Hewen, the hero of the drama was not impressed at all with her daughter's man and called him a coward for forsaking Brianna. Upon Roger's arrival to River Run, right before the Frasers left for Fraser's Ridge, the reunion which was beautiful and uneasy, was interrupted with the Redcoats coming to Aunt Jo Casta's, Maria Doyle Kennedy, mansion and delivering Governor Tryon, Tim Downey, a message to capture and kill Murtaugh. The season's conclusion was explosive, and despite so many burning questions the show left us reeling over, it was Roger's hesitance that still haunts the fans. Why did he not come back immediately after everything he did, and she did, for love? Why is Roger such a confusing character? While these questions may find varying answers and to each their own kind of opinions, the reason we did not see the Frasers react to Roger is because that sets us up for an important premise as to what comes next for the new time-traveling couple in Season 5. In a recent interview, the show's executive producer, Tony Graffia, stated Jamie will struggle to accept his new son-in-law for the foreseeable future. I think Jamie is naturally a protective father and is very hesitant about Roger, or any man. Would any man be good enough for his daughter? In season 4, Jamie met Brianna for the very first time and though there was a lot of love, everything went down the drain when Jamie beat Roger to a pulp, thinking he was her rapist, and Brianna loathed Jamie for the absurd things he said about her pregnancy. The relationship went so sour, Brianna called her father a savage, and the damage really seemed irreparable for some time. The finale put all to rest as Brianna forgave her father and her father proved his love by trying his best to get Roger to come back. However, Graffia added Jamie will never forget how much time Roger took to pledge his love to Brianna after he was told everything. This may cause a rift between father and daughter again, and could very well be the premise of the upcoming season. Roger also has a lot of grievances against the Scottish Highlander as he was the reason Roger was sold to the Mohawks. They both have a lot of proving to do. I think Jamie will never forget that Roger took more time than Jamie may have thought he should have taken to come back, Graffia said, adding, she thinks Brianna is more forgiving than her father. I think her father is being protective, but Bri knows that she and Roger have a fraught, turbulent beginning to their relationship. She's so happy to see him when he comes back and he says, take me to my son. I think for her that's the moment. While the future of Rogers and the Frasers' relationship is still not known, them not meeting in season 4's finale only proves there's more drama to unfurl. But one thing is for certain, the fate-driven drama has a trend of children not being raised by their biological parents, from William, who is now being raised by John Gray, to Brianna who was raised by Frank Randall, and even Roger and Claire themselves, who were raised by parents who did not share their blood. So. It does not matter whose child Brianna's baby boy is, he will still be a hero in this story.